of saturated in love where we dive deep into the vibration of love if you were led here i hope there's a message here for you if not feel free to schedule a personal reading if interested at the number four love.info i want to thank everybody who's been on this journey with me from the inception thanks for tuning in every now and again thank you holy spirit for your gift and for your guidance on behalf of dear taurus So there was somebody that seemed good for you and you ain't see it coming, but their energy is like, feels like it's been pulled back or the offer was reneged, rescinded. Knight of Swords. It's like they stopped rushing towards you. Everything was all good though, just a week ago, perhaps. And suddenly they flew out the sky, eight of wands in the reverse, stopped communicating. But look. You guys had equal energy, equal attraction, equal, you know, intention at some point. <laughs> then the communication ceased to exist. Then the love offer was rescinded unbeknownst to you. Somebody got scared. Started to crawl back. Knight of Pentacles at the top of your head. Now you're wondering, where is this person? Where are they off to? <laughs> oh, dear Taurus. You're thinking about when are they going to return? Why is it taking this guy so long or this gal so long? In the near future, Eight of Pentacles, you'll be working on this partnership. Eight of Cups right now, you feel like, hey, if they've gone, perhaps I should go too. You know, you feel like you're evolving, like you're walking away from a situation because somebody's not giving you the time of day that you desire. They're viewing you like they are causing you a damn headache. Five of Swords energy. This person knows that their lack of action suddenly, they're kind of, they like stopped right in their tracks, this person. Stopped right in their tracks when it was pertaining you and them, okay? So somebody got sidetracked, railroaded off. <laughs> what is going on? Why aren't you guys moving in sync anymore? We're about to catch the T on this, but somebody knows they've been a headache. In the near future, again, you will be still working on this partnership with the Eight of Pentacles there. Your hope to its service. Your hope is. Thank you, Holy Spirit. What does dear Taurus want from this connection, from this person who seems MIA? Ugh. Hang man in the reverse. Uh, you've been contemplating it and all you kind of want is this person's presence, you know? I feel like you're willing to build with somebody who feels like they are inadequate for you. So they could have come forth in the beginning and looked real good on paper like they had it together. But then the more you get to know them, the more they realize they can't hand, um, they can't like hold a candle to you. Maybe you have your affairs in order. Maybe you are a mature man or woman. This person still has things and tendencies that they didn't want you to figure out. So they kind of ghosted, okay? Uh, your hope is that this person just comes with their truth, that they can just come talk it out, that this person reappears. And now the Knight of Pentacles is the one that takes forever though, okay? So he's off looking for fulfillment. He's look, he, he or she is off the Knight, this Knight of Pentacles that you can't stop thinking of, that was so good, but then disappeared. That person is off seeking value within themselves before they could bring it to you, okay? Feelings of, in, of inadequacy has made somebody remove themselves from your life, Taurus. And strength in the reverse is your overall outcome here. Being that you can't see this person, being that they are running from you, fleeing from the connection, being that unbeknownst to you, the offer has been rescinded, okay? So whoever came to this reading without a clue, now you know this person went off and seek a value for themselves, this person felt like you was too good for them. They couldn't measure up. You thought it added up. You thought it was equal give and take. But this person knew that their hand was only out and it would never be the one on top. Okay? Oh, this Taurus. You might have just been protected, okay? Rejection served as your protection, dear Taurus. Holy Spirit. What is the romance angel's advice here? What can you confirm or deny for those in the collective who are in union, okay? For those in union, what can you confirm or deny? I feel like if you are in union, somebody just doesn't measure up. They don't feel like they measure up. Maybe you don't help them feel like they do. 
But work on the partnership. Work on trying to be a guiding light in their life, Eight of Pentacles. Work on less judgments being passed towards one another and more help. Let's work on constructive criticism, dear Taurus. Your advice is getting to know each other. Even if you've been together for two decades, guess what? Still more you can find out about that man or woman. I guarantee it. All right. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Getting to know you. This also serves as a heads up for those who are just talking to people. And again, it seemed like, oh, this person is my match, my equal, unbeknownst to you. They might flee from this romantic connection. So truly get to know them before you just give, 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 and then be mad that, oh, homie ran off with my heart. <laughs> oh, homie ran off with my finances. Oh, homie ran off with my car. <laughs> Oh no, let's get the police report in, okay? But get to know that man or woman that you call yourself talking to right now, all right? Because uh, things are a little iffy here, perhaps. Let's see. <laughs> oh, did Taurus. What else is going on for dear Tauruses in love, getting to know one another here? Woo. Heart with a key. It says, welcoming love, meeting the one. Open your heart, getting together. Perfect. Oh, how perfect it would be if we could give this Knight of Pentacles that we're thinking about our heart and slow and steady. He proves us right that we made the right decision. Okay, so just move with caution. Again, somebody I feel like may um, need some help from you in the near future and a part of that help is not giving up on them all right you guys could also work together go into business with one another okay the archetype of an individual you could be dealing with if this resonates slowly get to know each other okay so that there are no surprises here thank you holy spirit A Capricorn. Ooh, and look at them devil horns. Dear Taurus, you could be dealing with a Capricorn. And now you know if that's true, Capricorns damn sure are about their business. They are the master architects. They damn sure want to make sure they have success. All right. You could be a gypsy soul in this equation who's like, listen, just keep it real with me. I have enough for the both of us, you know, spiritually gifted, spiritually knowing that abundance is so much more than the material, but somebody needs you to guide them, shine your light on them. Somebody is too wrapped up in the ways of the world and somebody might just be walking out on a, 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 a true love because of this, okay? So Taurus, you could be dealing with a knight. See, this is somebody who pursues, pursues, pursues victory, right? They defend, defend their stance, their position. They go after what they want. They're safeguarded. This shield, this face covering, you may not truly get to know this knight ever. But if he stabs you, it's going to hurt, okay? <laughs> Get to know this person beneath the mask. Who is your knight, quote unquote, in shining armor? Oh, did Taurus. You were led here to truly ponder who is this knight in shining armor? Is it as shiny as it appears? Are these coins worth anything? Okay. We want to make sure we could cash out on any transactions future forward. So for those in relationships right now, just make sure you are investing wisely. And investing wisely, honeys, has to do with focus and attention on your partners. If they need help, who better than you to help them so they don't feel like they have to flee and get help outside of you. I feel like more and more couples in love are becoming also couples who make money together. Supplemental funds. Dear Taurus, work together in the near future. This way somebody knows that they are valuable and they don't have to seek that outside of you. 
fortune for those led here. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Just truly get to know each other. Work on your partnerships. Have courage as a final outcome, okay? You can help somebody see the value of staying with you and building with you. They don't have to go it alone to try and come back home when they're good and ready. You can do it together. True love conquers all. You guys can build together. Chariot, baby. It says charge ahead with confidence. Stay strong and focused. This is exactly what the Eight of Pentacles in the near future means. Stay focused, all right? This strength that came out in the reverse for you, Taurus, uh-uh, especially if you're dealing with a Leo, stay strong, all right? Show them that you're unwavering. Show them that you're willing to get to know them and to help them. Show them that partnership could bring the abundance that you both crave. They don't have to do it alone, all right? Don't let them sabotage what y'all got. Who is this knight in shining armor, dear Taurus? I bet you're going to come find out May 2021. <laughs> Be blessed. <laughs> Peace.